There are many different types of screwdrivers. Some common types of screwdrivers are, slotted, Phillips, Torx, stubby, multi-bit, and nut drivers. Each type of screwdriver has a unique tip that matches the head of specific screws. A slotted screwdriver has a flat tip. It is used to tighten or loosen slotted screws. A slotted screwdriver is also known as a flathead screwdriver. You can see an example of a slotted screwdriver to the right. A Phillips screwdriver has a cross, plus, shaped tip. Recall that a Phillips screw has a plus shaped indentation in the head of the screw. Phillips screwdrivers are designed to loosen or tighten Phillips head screws. A Torx screwdriver has a star shaped tip. It is used to tighten or loosen Torx screws. The star shaped head allows you to apply more turning force to Torx screws. You can see an example of a Torx screwdriver in the picture to the right. Most types of screwdrivers have a stubby version. Stubby screwdrivers are much shorter than the standard screwdriver. A stubby screwdriver is useful if you are going to be working in tight spaces. A multi-bit screwdriver is a screwdriver where you can change the head. Multi-bit screwdrivers allow you to loosen or tighten multiple types of screws. Multi-bit screwdrivers are very convenient if you are working with multiple types of screws. If you do not use a multi-bit, you will need to carry around each type of screwdriver. For example, you would need to have a Phillips, slotted, and Torx screwdriver. The bit of the screwdriver is secured by a magnet in the shaft. To remove the bit from the screwdriver, we need to pull on the bit until it is not connected to the magnet. Hold the handle of the screwdriver with one hand and the bit of the screwdriver with the other. Pull the bit away from the screwdriver. The bit should come out of the shaft. Insert your new bit into the shaft of the screwdriver. The tip of the bit should be facing away from the shaft. As you insert the bit, you will feel the bit connect to the magnet in the shaft. Gently pull on the bit to ensure that it is securely attached. A nut driver works like a screwdriver, but it is designed to tighten or loosen nuts and bolts. Just like a multi-bit screwdriver, a nut driver can be used on varying sizes and types of nuts or bolts. A nut driver has three parts, the handle, the shaft, and the socket. You will grip the nut driver by the handle. The shaft connects the socket and the handle together. The socket on a nut driver is a removable head. Using different sockets allows you to loosen or tighten different sizes of nuts and bolts. Unlike screwdrivers, the socket of a nut driver goes around the entire head of the nut or bolt. A nut driver works similar to a screwdriver. The head of the nut will go into the socket of the nut driver. You can see an example in the picture to the right. Press into the material and rotate the nut driver counterclockwise to loosen the nut. Rotate the nut driver clockwise to tighten the nut. Nuts and bolts come in a huge range of sizes. The socket on a nut driver can be changed to fit the head of the nut slash bolt you are working on. To change the socket size, pull the head of the socket away from the tip of the nut driver. Choose the correct size socket for the nut you are working on. Insert the new socket into the shaft of the nut driver. Gently pull on the socket to ensure it is secure. Choosing the correct socket for the nut driver depends on what nut and bolt you are using. The nut or bolt should fit tightly inside of the socket. The nut or bolt should have contact with all sides of the socket. If the socket is too small, it will not fit over the head of the nut or bolt. If the socket is too large, the nut will not contact the edges of the socket.